Yo guys, what's up? It's Dave, the Open Source Gangster here. So why bother buying a Nintendo DS when you can play DS games right on your Android device? And thanks to a new app called Jurassic DS Emulator, the performance is ultra smooth and many games are compatible with it. So let's get to it. Alright, step one. First you need to find an NDS ROM file. Now if you happen to have one lying around, then that is great. Otherwise, use Google search and I guarantee you will find an NDS ROM file in a matter of seconds. Step 2. After you have your NDS ROM file, transfer it to your Android device. Alright, now finally after you transfer the game to your Android device, what you want to do is download Jurassic DS Emulator from the Google Play Store. Now there is a demo version which gives you limited functionality but is free um, and free trial for 30 minutes. I encourage you to buy the full version, but of course, if you want to test it out first, like I'm doing, definitely download the demo version for free. So let's open this up. We're going to load a new game. Go down to where you place your NDS ROM. Here we go. And I'm going to start game. And right now, I'm loading up my favorite game of all time on a Nintendo DS, Animal Crossing. Alright, so right now we're inside Ammo Crossing. Like I said, a really good game. I love this game. Um, the performance is extremely smooth, which I'm really happy about. This is extremely playable without any lags. It's maybe a tad bit slower than what would be normally on a DS, but it's really nothing noticeable. Alright, so Ammo Crossing really does not make use of the top screen other than really the time setting. So I want this screen to be my main screen, as you see, or like the main window that I look at. So what I can do is go down here and go to the little invert thing. Then I can tap this. And here I have pretty much my bottom screen as my main window, which is nice because it makes better use of screen real estate, which I like. And if you want to achieve the full DS effect with the top and bottom window, all you need to do is hold your phone in portrait mode. And as you can see, I have the top window and bottom window, just like on a DS. So, alright guys, this has been how to play Nintendo DS games on your Android device. Like I said, it's pretty cool and fun, and it works for most Nintendo DS games, and performance is extremely smooth. There is hardly any lag in this whatsoever, and it's definitely worthwhile to do. So, go ahead, I encourage you to try it out for yourself, and have fun with it. So, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for another Gal Nights video. Thanks.